Hi friends, I am Shreya and I am here with a new video. So in this video, I will show you how to draw the paramecium. So this is its border. It's lo it looks like footwear, right? Now here it's cilium. It's very difficult to draw it. Cool. I'll show you in short. These are food vacuoles. This is macronucleus and this is micronucleus. These are collecting kennels. These are flower shape. Here it's Galet. Lysosomes throughout its whole body. We have to show its pellicle so it will be double bordered. I have shaded it to look attractive. But it's not compulsory. You can do it if you have enough time. So let's start labeling with cilia. Uh, we will call it cilia. Its function is locomotion and ingestion of food. This is pellicle which helps to maintain shape and protects internal organelles from mechanical injuries. Now these are cytopes or called as anal pore. It is point for waste discharge in the body. Macronucleus that is center for all metabolic activities and this small one is micronucleus that is storage site for the germline genetic material these both are food vacuoles and helps in digestion this is oral groove or called as vestibulum which gathers food and direct it in mouth These are lysosomes. Its enzymes break down food molecules and conduct a form of digestion. Now this flower shape. This center is called as contractile vacuole which removes waste and excess water. And its petal like structure are called as kennels which absorb water by osmosis from the cytoplasm. Inside there are thread like structures called as trichocyst which can be ejected in response to certain stimuli. So this is done with the paramoecium. Example of animal like protista. I have colored this diagram to understand it better. So this is done. So thank you friends for watching my video. Please like, share and subscribe.